I'm a patient care tech for our clinical staffing office, which means that I either um, do what we call work in the floor, or I do what we call safety assistance, or better known as sitter cases, where I sit with one patient one-on-one. -on -one. Because they're a danger to themselves or others. Some because they have um, mental disabilities. I've always been the person that goes, oh, I see somebody in need, can I help? It's natural for me. My grandmother had Alzheimer's. I took care of her from the beginning till the end. Um, my other grandmother had lung cancer. I also took care of her from beginning till end. We do have different restraints. There are different levels for different people. Mainly it's for their safety though, to make sure they don't fall, to make, to make sure they don't hurt themselves, and to make sure they don't hurt staff. It takes a whole lot of patience to be calm when someone's trying to hit you, because <laughs> that happens. A lot of times if you just talk to somebody though, they can calm down. They won't try to hurt themselves. They can see a brighter picture just from your conversation. I recently had a patient that the patient cries literally all night, moans and groans all night. But if I sit there and actually hold her hand, she'll stop crying. I have held a patient's hand for almost 16 hours with no problem. Um, if that's what keeps them calm, I have no problem with doing that. A lot of times they're just like you and I. They're calm, they're cool, they're collected, and sometimes they'll come back and apologize. Even if they don't, the fact that they're not in the same space that you sat with them before and they no longer need a sitter or a safety assistant, that is enough, like it's very gratifying. I like the people that I work with. They're um, very happy-go-lucky like me. <laughs>